All right, here's how to cross staff. First, you'll need to be in the selection tool and you'll need to highlight a measure that you want to cross staff or a region or any, you need to highlight some notes. Okay, once you do that, you're going to, on Windows, hold down Control, Alt, and then press the down arrow and that'll shift it all the way to the bottom staff. And to reverse it, you just hold Shift, Alt, and then the up arrow and that'll move it up to the top. That is so much better than using this horrendous, stupid, this terrible, awful tool called the Note Mover tool. It's, oh my God, I loathe it. It's, it's horrible. You have to click here, it comes up with these handles, and then you have to pray that the notes move to the respective positionings and half the time it doesn't work. And if you do that, it's, 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 I mean, it's working great right now, but my God, there's been so many instances where it doesn't work. This needs to die. So anyway, so another issue you run into, let's, let's say if you're in layers and you want to have this C and this B in the bottom staff. Well, yes, select it and you do what I just told you, shift, alt, and then uh, down arrow, then you see we have this little issue with the collisions. So how do we fix this? So this is where things get a little complicated. By default, we need to look down here in these, the, um, the bottom left-hand corner. You'll see these numbers going from one, two, three, four. Those are your layers. The red is the second layer. The blue is the top, is the first layer. For you, this might be black and red as opposed to dark blue. And I can show you in a future video how to change colors of the layers. Anyway, so you'll need to isolate this layer. So you'll need to, sh here's, here's what you do, okay? If you want the bottom layer, here's just what you do. Click to, or you can do, if you want a shortcut, uh, shift, alt, and the number two, uh, look down here, shift, alt, and one, that's first layer you see it's selected. Shift Alt two, three, four. You'll, if you're writing contrapuntal music, you'll get used to the shortcut quite a lot instead of having to click down here. Uh, so Shift Alt and pick a number. So you'll need to be in the second layer to get these notes. And then Shift Alt and the letter S, S as in Sally, to get to this point, to only, to isolate only layer two. Then once you do that, go ahead and highlight uh, the notes you want selected, and then do control, uh, shift, alt, and then bottom layer. Or, sorry, shift, shift, alt, and then the down arrow. And then shift, alt, and then S to get to, to show all layers. Um, now, if you want the top, you'll need the, the first layer, the top layer, you'll need to have number one selected. And what this will do is just show layer one by doing uh, shift, alt, and S. It'll just eliminate the second layer. And if you have layer three, um, obviously there's no layer three in this piece, so it won't show anything. Shift, alt, S, and there you go, bam. Um, and that's how you cross staff very easily, much better in Finale as opposed to using the awful, horrible note mover tool. I mean, how many times have you used this thing and to just, oh, no, 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 we're not going there. We're not going there. By the way, bonus bonus tip for you. You see this little collision right here that might happen? Uh, you see all these accidentals are colliding to the notes. Looks pretty hideous, right? Control A, highlight everything, and then Control and the number four on the number row will automatically space out the music and uh, problem solved right there. All right, hope that helped you guys out. Uh, leave a like if this helped you out. And uh, if you really enjoyed it, go ahead and consider subscribing and that will uh, showcase that I am doing okay. And um, well, have a good one. Thank you for watching.